What's going on everybody? This is Cody, the home theater hobbyist. Today it is time for an upgrade. It's time to upgrade our theater seating. Valencia Theater Seating sells a ton of different styles, colors, and configurations of chairs for your theater. If you need a single chair, they've got that. If you need a love seat, if you need a row of six, a row of two, a row of four, they have all of those different configurations. So check out that link in the description below so you can figure out which chair and option really works best in your room. Now for me, Valencia sent me these. These are the, let me just say it, Tuscany Ultimate Luxury Edition. I'll say that one more time. Tuscany Ultimate Luxury Edition. That's right, they've upgraded the Tuscanies. Uh, they still have the Tuscany line, but this has a few upgrades. Now, a few years ago, I got an opportunity to review the Tuscany 2.0s, and I like that series. I thought it was a great series, but they've made upgrades. Uh, that series had 11,000 series Italian Napa leather. This has 20,000 series Italian Napa leather. This has a nice French diamond stitch pattern. It also has seven different LED colors, whereas the Tuscany 2.0s had a single LED color. This has a USB-C port so you can charge your phone, your tablet via USB-C if you want to, which is really nice to have. And it also has a feature I requested, and that is a built-in memory function. The 2.0s didn't have the memory function. So if you want a chair with memory function, you need to go with the Ultimate Luxury Edition, right? Just wanna say that one more time. But yeah, so I'm looking forward to checking out these chairs. And by the way, full disclosure, they did say that I can keep these chairs. I just wanna be out there and honest about that, okay? So, said that. Now, let's talk about what they sent me. They sent me the row of two configuration. That's why I have two boxes here. And these ship via freight. Now, my freight companies have always reached out to me whenever they've had a freight delivery. So hopefully yours will too, and you can schedule it for a time when you are at home. Now, you need to make sure you have a buddy because these are extremely heavy. They ship on a pallet. This box was on top of this box and they are extremely heavy. This box is about 160 pounds and this is like 140 pounds. So I could not move these without help. I had my neighbor help me bring them up the stairs and we were sweating by the time we made it up with these two boxes because they are heavy. Now, once I'm, they're up here, I can move them around. I can push them around on the carpet. They're easy to slide around. But if you have any steps or anything, just get some help, don't be ashamed, okay? Especially if you get like a row of six, that's gonna be a lot of chairs to move. But this, uh, each box contains both the bottom of the chair and the back of the chair. Uh, so it should be pretty easy and simple once I get them out of the box based on my Tuscany 2.0 experience. And I'm really looking forward to getting these out of the box because I'm a little bit tired and it's nice to be able to do an unboxing and then just sit down and relax in the unboxing. But anyways, enough talk, let's get these boxes open. Oh yeah, I should probably mention one thing. They do tell you how to unbox these things on the top of the box. So I'm just going to follow their instructions to get these out of the box. They smell good, <laughs> they smell good. So the instruction manual actually came in one of the pockets along with Not totally sure what this is for yet. Looks like uh, maybe something you can put on your floor to keep the, f uh, the feet from scraping the floor because there are eight of them. So it's probably just some little pads you can stick under the feet. But yeah, it's just the assembly, uh, assembly instructions to put the back on and also what the different functions are on the button down here.
So here we are, the Tuscany Ultimate Luxury Edition. First impressions. Well, I'll say that the leather is pretty soft on the skin. Um, obviously still you know, fairly stiff. I haven't worn them in yet because they're fresh out of the box and it smells really good in here. <laughs> you can smell the leather. Um, as far as the seat comfort is concerned, I would say it's medium firm. Um, so it's nice and supportive and I can feel just a little bit of sync with it. Uh, that might change a little bit as time wears on, but it feels nice. Um, the uh, French diamond stitch pattern here, I think looks really good with these chairs and you can see the lights are on. Once I plug them in, uh, the lights instantly came on and started going through the different LED colors. So that's pretty cool. And um, up here, these little plastic uh, things, they're actually covering up the accessory port. So you can buy like tray tables, uh, wine glass holders, cell phone holders, stuff like that, and just put in here and uh, have that. And of course you got the cup holders right here. And then under my arms are the armrest and there is storage under here so you can put remotes and stuff like that. But I'll talk about that more in the full review. Um, let's look at the power recline. So right here I've got the power recline so I can put my feet up nice. And um, there are also lights under there so the LEDs are there, but there's my feet right there. So that's really nice because you can power recline and they've also got lumbar support and head support. So that feels really good and I, again i kind of like have my feet up so i might just do that a little bit more um but as far as the unboxing is concerned it took me i don't know something like 45 minutes or something like that to do i wasn't in any rush but it's actually pretty easy to do but i would recommend the person that you get to help bring you uh bring the chairs in you ask them to help you unbox them as well because you can do it by yourself but it's much easier to pull the boxes off of the chairs if you have an extra set of hands to kind of get them because the box is kind of wide but um, otherwise it's actually pretty easy as far as uh, setting these things up it's pretty much a breeze I mean you pull them out of the plastic and out of the bags that they're in and you got the base that's down and then the actual back of the chair is just laying inside the chair like this you pull it off and then there's two little arms that it just slides in place and then they click into place so you know that it's locked in there's two cables that you have to connect one is lumbar and the other is i think the recline function and they're labeled one is red you know the two red ones go together and then the one that's not red they go together so it's really easy to put those together plug in power hit the power switch on the chairs and you are good to go the only other thing you have to do or you can do you can choose to do it or whatever but is connect the two chairs together they've kind of got a little alligator tooth thing going with a little notch on the other side of the chair so they just slide in place and lock into place so it keeps the chairs together and there's a you know a section on each side so if you have more than the row two or the row three you can connect them together so like i said it's really easy um, I like them a lot. They feel really nice, nice and soft and smell really good. Uh, but I will be doing a full review. I do want to, you know, kind of break these in just a little bit. And then I'll talk about everything that I find after I spend some time with them. But they do have a USB-A and a USB-C port down here. So that's really cool. And so that's all I have. But if you have questions, drop them in the comment section below and I'll try to answer them in the full review. Thank you guys for watching. Please don't forget to like, subscribe and comment because that does let other people know about the channel. You know, the likes are good, the subscriptions are good, all that's good. Notification, uh, watching all the videos, <laughs> we really appreciate that. But again, I will be doing a full review on these, so thank you guys for watching. I'll talk to you next time.